Hello and bestie besties, welcome back to the channel. If you are new here, hello, my name is Shalice. I am just someone who was addicted to investing and building her family's money. And I hope that you will feel comfortable enough to subscribe, like, and share this video. We are very open, very transparent and easy going around here. And we talk all things investing and building our wealth. We make things very simple. And I take you inside of our many investment accounts, showing our real numbers to give you some inspiration and motivation to what your money can do. And if you are a returning Investy Bestie, air hugs. Thank you so much for coming back. I always appreciate you guys being here. Again, I am not a financial advisor. I am not a fiduciary, but I do believe in sharing financial knowledge. And like I said, I show all of our real numbers on the internet. I mean, who does that anymore, okay? But it's just to show you guys how open I am and I really am passionate about changing the face of wealth because I do wanna be the Oprah of the investing world, okay? I'm naming it and I'm claiming it, okay? I wanna be the Oprah of the investing world. <laughs> Don't laugh at me, guys. But yes, yeah, so in this video, we're going to have a jammed, packed one talking all about investing. You guys are going to be coming along and investing with me. I'm going to take you into our cryptocurrency portfolio over at Coinbase. You're going to be investing in Robinhood with me, and you're going to be investing in interactive brokers, which houses our growth stocks. So a lot of investing going on, but I love these types of videos. I started doing these videos like back in January because I love having visuals. I'm a visual learner. I need to see what people are clicking on and getting some of the method behind why they chose this company, how to research stocks, what are their strategy and plan. And I figured, you know what, maybe someone else will be interested in seeing that from someone who has been investing now for a couple of years. I do believe in making things very easy and beginner friendly for my peoples because I wanna make sure that you guys can understand and then build your own portfolios up, okay? So before I get into that, I want to do a quick update on the $1 a day investing challenge for November. I know a lot of you are doing it as well. Thank you so much for your support. Thank you for filming your journey, for encouraging others to get started, for supporting me and my business but I just appreciate all the love and the support from all of you guys. You just have no idea, okay? But my daughter did give me her investing challenge. So she's in school. Today is the 11th of November. So happy Veterans Day to all the veterans out there. We really do appreciate your service to our country. And my daddy is a Vietnam vet. So happy Veterans Day to him too. But look at this, guys. My baby is making progress. I'm so proud of her. And I know you guys are proud of your internet niece because so many of you guys call her that and just showing your love and support. And I really do appreciate it. And she does too. You guys have her blushing. <laughs> so this is her updated copy. And she did give me her $1 bills right here. So I'm going to count it on screen for you guys. One, two, three. And she told me to say shmoney, okay? So three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So eleven dollars. So just continue to stay focused and consistent on your journeys with this challenge, okay? This challenge is just one dollar on my website, mt1finance.com. It is very easy, very beginner friendly, and it does not break the bank. Just one dollar a day, guys. Less than a cup of coffee from Star Breezy or Dunkin' Donuts, okay? And you're saving for your future. And some of you guys are doing this for kids as well. So shout out to Jocelyn over at Cash Me at Paradise. She's doing this for her nieces, guys. So yes, you can do this for children. Date. My daughter decided to do something else. So when I listed this tracker on this video, I will link right here. I told you guys that she was the inspiration behind this and she wants to buy some Roblox stocks. So if you guys have children or teens, you know exactly what I'm talking about and how expensive that thing is, okay? It's expensive, all right? And they just love it. And so she wants to be an owner in it. And I've been talking about be a consumer and an owner. And my baby is listening, y'all. When you have a 15-year-old and they listen to you, ooh, that's a blessing, okay? That's a blessing. And so she wants to put $100 in it in her teen fidelity account. Yes, you can have an account for your teens. I think it starts at 13. I'll have a screenshot here, but she does have one. She just wants to put $100 and she shaded in her first lower piggy and $10 is what she had. And she gave me her $10. <laughs> I'm proud of my baby. Yeah, Y'all know I'm a proud mom and I know y'all are proud internet aunties and uncles. Okay. Whew, that's my baby. Okay. And shout out to Shy's babies as well because those are my internet investing nieces. Okay. So 
Yes, let's get our kids a part of this movement as well so that they can go ahead and have head start into life so they don't have to struggle as much so they can go ahead and buy a house or go to college and I have to worry about money and all of that. But you know, just let's give our babies a head start because they are the future. Okay, so I just wanted to say that. I'm going to head to the laptop so that I can screen share and we're going to be doing a lot of investing today okay so thank you guys so much and i'll see y'all over there all right all right guys so we are here in our coinbase account again you can see our portfolio balance sixteen thousand four hundred fifty seven dollars and sixteen cents you can also see all of our assets right here we have a little over two coins of ethereum we have 0.6 of Bitcoin and then you can see all the rest of our portfolio. Many of these cryptos you see were all earned for free via the learn and earn. So if you click that when you go on over to your crypto account, they, they give you usually opportunities to do free quizzes and you can learn more about cryptocurrency and earn free crypto. So I did a couple of these already, but you can see what I'm talking about here. You just answer, you take some quizzes, you answer some questions, you learn more about cryptocurrency and you get some free crypto. So it's a win-win situation in my book. And so we have Clover, Stellar, Bounce Token. Again, we've earned, let me see, go back. $92 so far in free crypto and that is just what we earned that is not what it has risen to because we have bought and hold the crypto I'll give you an example of it so down here if you click interest earned so we've earned two dollars and eighteen cents just from holding crypto and that was from algo so if I click algo algo is was one of the free cryptos that we earned from watching the videos and taking the quizzes and they actually are giving us interest on something they gave to us for free. Let me say that again. They're giving us 4% interest on something they gave to us for free. I'm telling you, it, it goes deep when you invest, guys, okay? And let me go down to Algo. So this $79.73 was free. You see these rewards? Free. All I did was take the quiz and they just give me 4% APR every month. I did not buy the algo so if you get a chance and you do sign up for coinbase and they give you an opportunity to take a quiz answer some questions try to do that guys and then you can hold that crypto long term they may give you some interest and if no interest it'll just grow remember it grew to 79 where is it 79 dollars and 73 cents right here we have 40.32 of algo okay so i really do love to learn and earn but we're going to buy some crypto today so we're going to buy ether first so i'm going to click on ethereum and then i'm going to go up oh, let me move my screen up sorry guys i'm going to click buy sell this is how you buy and sell cryptocurrency on coinbase you don't want to click here this is how you can actually send crypto to someone else we're not doing that we're just adding to our portfolios so we're going to click buy and then we're going to put in Ethereum $50. We're transferring $150 today out of our first paycheck. We're going to buy $50 worth of Ethereum with our Coinbase account. So you do have to have your checking account linked to your platform. This is with M1, Robinhood. It doesn't matter what it is, Fidelity. You have to have your checking account linked. We're going to preview our buy. So we're going to buy 0 0.01 of Ether. Every little bit adds up. It is currently over 4,700 bucks. The fee is $199. Yes, Coinbase just charge you a fee. And we're going to click buy now. So we just got to wait. It's going to upload and update and make sure that our order goes through. And our order was successfully purchased. Now we're going to go back and we're going to buy $100 of Bitcoin. We're going to click buy. We're going to buy $100 of Bitcoin from our Capital One account. Preview buy. And again, like before, <laughs> and Bitcoin is actually over 65,000. It was actually at 68,000 like two days ago. So Bitcoin is the future, guys. Again, do your research, but we love cryptocurrency and we'll continue to just invest in it. Okay, so our purchase was successfully completed and we have 0 0.00148824 of Bitcoin, okay? <laughs> so we're gonna go back to our assets. And again, guys, if you do want to open up a Coinbase account or any of the accounts you will see today, that's Robinhood, M1, anything like that, all of my referral links are down below. If you use the referral links, you will get either free crypto, free uh, money, free bonuses. And I really do appreciate you guys when you do use my referral links. It does not cost you anything to use it. It just benefits 
both of us and I know a lot of you have been saying you've been using them to say thank you for all of the videos and the support and the encouragement when it comes to investing and I really really do appreciate you guys when you do use my affiliate links and again I'm sending major air hugs to all of you for your support with my channel with just you know helping me to change the face of wealth so we are done with our crypto and we're going to head on over to our robin hood account and buy some dividend stocks there so stay tuned all right investy besties we are here in our robin hood account so this is where all of all of our dividend stocks are and as you guys know we are building up this dividend portfolio specifically for early retirement okay we need to have some other income to live off of and this is just one way we plan on achieving that is having dividends you guys can see if we go to all we are actually up over 48 percent in this portfolio 48 percent for the year we are up 46 percent we're going to invest this money so that we can go ahead and have some dividends so i'm going to get some more mo and just real quickly guys if you don't know how to find a company just search button is right here and i've talked about this in previous videos it's really really simple to find companies so if you want to find walmart so walmart is one of our picks for our november investing challenge you just can type in the company walmart that way if you don't know the ticker and ticker is just these and a small acronym to represent the company so Walmart's ticker is WMT or you can just type out the whole name and it'll come up and then you'll get some information about the company the CEO where it's headquartered you'll get some key facts about the company that's very important like market cap it'll tell you what the high was so far this year what the low was if it pays a dividend how much volume so on and so forth and any news okay any news that may come out they have some analyst ratings, but even some of these you want to take with a grain of salt. I like to do my research on Market Watch. Those are great places. Uh, Seeking Alpha is another great place. Yahoo Finance is another great place. But again, analyst ratings has this one at 77% buy and then has earnings. So really, really easy to find information about the company. It's just you just got to look for it and it's right there for you. So let's go on and go down to Altria. Altria, that's the name of the company, but the ticker symbol is MO. We currently have 40 shares of this. I want to, my short term goal is 50 shares of this. And because we are down, this is a great opportunity to buy some shares. The markets are down, which is normal. We've had what, eight straight days of gains. So pullbacks are very healthy. And honestly, as an investor, I want to see a pullback because anything that goes straight, straight, straight up usually comes crashing down so we want to buy two shares at ninety dollars and seventeen cents again you see i'm investing in shares not in dollars today but i have invested in dollars before shares two shares we're going to do a market price we can you can do limits and limits is just saying i want to buy altria at like forty to five dollars and one cent okay forty five dollars and one cent it will not execute your order unless altria gets to forty five dollars and one cent but market is saying i will pay whatever price it is when i press submit and right now it is forty five dollars and eight cents honestly in my experience i just figured paying two cents three cents more doesn't really change too much in terms of the math and i'm a buy and hold investor so we're going to buy that and it's done it was purchased and going back to the main page we have four hundred and thirteen dollars and twenty two cents left um so all realty income is a dividend company that pays every month and so i do want to get one share in that so we can currently build up our position so we're going to click buy and we should have if i refresh this 36 shares and we do have a dividend paying again they pay dividends every month so this is one of my favorites moving on i wanted to buy some coke ko ticker symbol ko i'm trying to get this to 30 shares at least so that's 1.86 shares so i'm going to come here type in 1.86 that is going to be 105 dollars and 42 cents we're going to click review order and click buy that order was placed and it was purchased again just being consistent with our investing a little bit goes a long way guys okay so next we want to get some pfizer pfizer has been one of my favorites and we're up oh, almost 23 percent on this so it's time to definitely get some more pfizer and so i definitely want to get a share and a half of this so that way we can get there we go about 23 shares so i'm going to review that order 
and I'm going to place that order and it was bought. All right, moving on to OKE. I wanted to get some more shares in this. We're up almost 13%. So I wanted to go ahead and get some shares and I wanted to get one share of OKE. We're done. And just so you know, it has all the information down here of what OKE is. Again, we like to say diversified and this is how much the dividend is pending for November, $18.71. Moving on, let's see how much we have left. $92.36. Woo, a lot of goodies. What do we want to get? You know what? Cisco is down. So I always like to focus on the companies that are red for the day when I am buying and just go from there. So we have, let's see, Cisco system. Okay, let's go ahead and get one share of that. That way we can buy on the dips. We are buy low and we buy and hold investors. We're going to put the rest of this $35.27 into BP, which is oil dollars we're going to go to 30 how much do i have left oh here 35.27 one share 1.27 shares of bp that is okay and that is done so those are all of our trading for the day we have no money left no buying power all right guys so we are here in our interactive brokers account so we have about a little over $53,000. Again, the market did fall uh, the past two days. So it is a red market. But we, again, we buy low and we buy and hold. So we're not going to do too much in this account. We're just going to get some Southwest. I really do like Southwest Airlines. We are in, you can see the chart. And this is more of a technical analysis. So it was at about $64, almost $65 back in April. But it is currently down here at the bottom. So we want to continue to buy low because you know the traveling industry will come back and we wanna make sure that we can take advantage when we do have a great sale. So we're going to click buy over here. I'm not buying 100 shares of this. I am just going to buy three shares, $148.95. I'm going to do a limit order. And again, I'm going to click submit order. Let me move my screen down some so that you guys can see. Okay, we're gonna click submit order. We're going to click accept and the order right here you see has been filled okay let me go on let's go back to our portfolio positions they move the screen up some next we are going to go down so tesla did kind of do a major pullback but we are up almost five thousand dollars on this position and we do have 10 whole shares of tesla and we do have tesla inside of different funds so we really do like tesla for the future I want to get some more Disney. So Disney did not have the best earnings report. Again, they are suffering. Their parks are really suffering because of the pandemic. But again, Disney has a lot of growth ahead of them and we want to just buy low. So I'm going to click buy here and we're going to get three shares of Disney to make it an even 15 shares. We're going to click submit our order, accept and we're going to see it says the order has been submitted great and it'll fill our order we're going to go back to our portfolio and i think the last thing that i wanted to buy was um here we go arc genomics so i really am a big fan of kathy woods we are down in this position um but i'm going to buy as you know the market continues to go low because i do believe in the different stocks that are in this position. And again, ARC is, is a little risky now, keep that in mind. But again, we do believe that this is the future and we're going to click buy. We currently have 15 shares and we're going to get three more shares for $220. And we're going to click buy order, click accept. And the order has been filled, click done. And we are finished with buying our positions and our interactive brokers. All right, guys, and finally we are here in our stock spreadsheet so this is what i use to track all of our accounts and you guys can see all the tabs down here and being organized is, is just as important as investing okay so you just saw our interactive brokers accounts so yeah this is how we keep track and then if you come down here to this graph this is the allocation remember being diversified in the sectors is just as important if you want to know the 11 sectors of the stock market check out this video here where you can go ahead and take a look at that very super simple easy and beginner friendly and it'll really expose you to why it's so important to be diversified and also guys if you want to have a very beginner friendly way of tracking your stocks i do have a portfolio tracker 
up on my website that you can write it in. But I also have this spreadsheet as well if you feel like you're ready for something a little bit more advanced. And of course, this is our Robinhood over here. Again, all the different sectors. Again, the sector allocation down here just trying to be organized and diversified when it comes to our money. So that is the video, guys. I hope that you enjoyed it. Let me know if you made any moves again for the month of November so far or for October. Again, guys, thank you so much for being here. I really do appreciate it. If you have any questions, drop them down below. And until next time, I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye, guys.